Okay, so I'm going to be showing my Lifetime movie actresses first. I said actresses, not actors, because they're all female. So these have been obtained either through DM, email, or another way. Um, these are all people who I've seen in a Lifetime movie. Um, the movies literally change titles, like... <laughs> I have four autographs and the four movies literally had one title that I know it as and then they changed the title. I don't know why they do that so I'm just not going to say what movie they're from because I'm going to probably say the wrong movie. But the first is Taylor Jabra. Love that it's on a headshot. That doubles as her literally like what casting directors get. Then I got Kylie Bush. So we'll put this right there. Um, she was in a movie that also <laughs> changed title. <laughs> uh, she, um, I won't spoil it, but let's say there was a plot twist. So, um, loved that movie so she also wrote me a note so the movie she was in was okay so it was secrets in the wilderness which was a new title but it used to be called remote danger but she wrote me this note which was so sweet and basically she was telling me that one of her co-stars in the movie is another is a co-star in another movie with her and i love that she like wrote like happy holidays i absolutely love when i get letters like this with people's autographs i didn't with taylor if i got the rest the rest of my lifetime people i did but taylor emailed me um answering my questions sometimes they do that or they actually write them out so everyone was so sweet so then i got jc nicole's autograph and she wrote on the back which so not only did she provide a signed photo she also sent me this polaroid that she took and wrote for lauren which is actually so cool i think polaroids are just the coolest thing and this is actually my second signed or second polaroid i've gotten from a celebrity which is so cool and then this is my note i got from her You can pause to read it. Then the last lifetime person I got in January slash February is Brendy Green, who took the time to write the most thoughtful note. So you could pause to read it. She was in The Lake House Murders or Deadly X Next Door, whatever they ended up calling it. And I don't know, I re oops, I really don't know why they do like one name and then go with another but like the thought she put into this and i loved reading her answers and then this paragraph just wow that paragraph just really like showed who she is as a person you could just tell she's so sweet and she really 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 took the time so those are all my lifetime people that i got in january and february of 2022 again it's insane that we are in 2022 but here we are so the two autographs the only two autographs i got through the mail from via the Ginny and georgia's georgia set was brianne howie she signed the two photos i sent asking her to sign to lauren the other photo I sent her was for my autograph collector friend in Germany, Spenja, who I had given the via venue address to Fate Winks in Ireland because she watches that, I watch it, and 
I had no clue how to write the address out to Ireland, and I really didn't think it would work. And I knew she was a huge fan, so I was like, I'll give you the address, but can you send a photo on behalf of me? So, I did the same thing for Jenny and Georgia. For her, I sent a photo on behalf of her. And only Brianne replied, I sent to three other cast members, and I haven't heard back, but that's okay. Um, Brianne was so sweet. She, like, didn't just sign her name. She actually wrote stuff, even on Spenja's, so love that. So this is the only through-the-mail success I got. But hey, in a two-month period, that's not that bad. It could be nothing. So there's that. Then purchases. <laughs> there's a lot. So the first is Leslie Bibb. Then we have Scott MacArthur from The Mick, on The Mick photo. Great show, I miss it so much. Then we have Carly Hughes from American Housewife. And then from Gossip Girl, we have Connor Palo, who I've never seen his autograph before and it's on a headshot, so I love that. Then I took the personalization off the two of these, but the following three are from a bundle from the same seller. So first we got Jenna Boyd, and you may be like, wow, she looks familiar. Who is she? She's from Atypical, but this is a very young photo of her. It said to Clinton here, and I got rid of it, and I'm very, like, surprised. And I noticed that this kind of, like, matte photo is the easiest to get rid of personalization. So we got Jenna Boyd here. And then I also was able to take away the two Clinton on Devin's autograph. It's a little more glossy, but it worked. And then Amber Childs, who I was not able to take the personalization off of just because of the color and like, it's a little more rough. I'm petting her nose. <laughs> it's a little more rough of a, like material, but I still love it. She was Candace in you so these three are from the same seller and they're all young photos of the actors which is really cool but uh, second to last eight by ten here is one of my favorites i got dennis o'hare from murder house on a signed murder house photo well, from American Horror Story on a signed Murder House photo. Absolutely love it. It came from this convention and it has a COA. Then I got Nolan North, which <laughs> I thought was real because it looked it, right? No, it's a preprint. You could see now up close it is, but that's okay because it's such a cool promo and I mean... Hey, you gotta be back in 1999 in order to get this, so not many people have it. And this is a preprint, but, like, it's what they would hand out at tapings. It's a Fuller House preprint. If you remember, I have one. Um, I guess you could say it's, like, the season one one. But then my Runaways trading cards signed. These six were in or from December and these three are from January. I love that it looks like a full deck even though it's not really a full deck. Still love it. And it's with my signed Umbrella Academy ones that I love so much. We had a secret Santa that I did with some of my autograph collector friends and I got Retta from Liv and I love the trading card. Then, I can't put this in the binder because it's trapped. But no, I love this Sir Reginald Hardgrave signed trading card. I paid $10, free shipping. What? I thought I was gonna be out big. And then Melissa from Teen Wolf, but this was on the Teen, teen? The Walking Dead photo. 
It's a little blurry and personalized, but that's okay. I'm very excited I was able to add her to my collection. Holiday card that Jennifer Goodwin sent to the press. And the person I bought it from is press. And they post so many press things, it's insane. But when I saw this, I knew I had a bid because her autograph's not easy to come by. I love her handwriting and I got her autograph now. So I love it. And then my very, 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 very bad what my very last and best autograph that i bought in january slash february does not need an explanation it's this gorgeous ariana grande i love flipper which makes it really reminds me of a dolphin but i love it so much and I wish I could hang it up, but I literally have no room. Like, I'm not even kidding. This wall is filled. So those I bought this Teen Wolf signed poster, which makes it my third cast autograph. I'm trying to sell the other one, which just has um, Tyler Holland and Dylan on it. But I love this. I've never seen it either. And it has crystal. So those are all the autographs I got. Um, gonna leave it on one republic right now those are all the autographs i got it's drooping it's drooping down <laughs> those are all the autographs i got in january and february i hope to add 25 more to my collection if not more for march and april so far i have two just two so got a little ways to go <laughs> um but yeah thank you so much for watching watching it droop up my wall as well um and i'm very excited to see what i get in march and april so in the meantime you can follow my instagram and i'm also going to link all the friends i mentioned their instagrams because they have incredible collections okay it's just drooping up now so i'm gonna go <laughs> bye i don't know why i waved <laughs>